my name is Christine Chiz. I've been a researcher here in Luxembourg since 1994. Um, I'm interested in how we as humans think and how the thinking is developing. Passion interest that I have in my research group is the development of how we think about numbers and how we use them to calculate. Uh, recently, we've also been looking into how we read. Um, this is a very important question, of course, because as you know, in school we learn these uh, things and we try with our research to foster learning and to help develop the best possible learning and instruction strategies. For example, we found out that uh, language is playing a huge role also in mathematical learning. And uh, this is knowledge that's important to have for Luxembourgish school. As you know, Luxembourg has a multilingual school system and Luxembourg itself is a multilingual country. So we're trying to inform with our research uh, on multilingual calculation and mathematics, how schools are best uh, designed to be fit for the Luxembourgish uh, school population. So in my research, we discovered how um, thinking about numbers and doing arithmetic is influenced by language and how this affects the brain. For example, we could show that when you do math in your second language of mathematical learning in Luxembourg, that would be typically French, this comes with a certain costs compared to the first language of math learning, which in Luxembourg would be typically German. And we even saw that this changes the way our brain is activating while we are calculating in this second language. Another of our really striking findings is that we show that in young children, when they think about numbers, this is automatically associated with space, such that even in preschool, before children learn how to read and write, when they think of small numbers, they shift their spatial attention to the left and when they think about large numbers, they associate it with the right side of space. And that was something that um, was important to find out because it shows that this association between numbers and space comes very early on in development. When doing research, it's also very important to try and further develop the methods that we are using. And in our group, we have been championing the use of uh, EEG, electroencephalography, in combination with a very fast periodic visual stimulation. This is allowing us to measure brain activity in all different kinds of ages in automatic fashion and it provides a very special glimpse in, into how uh, elderly adults and even young children are thinking and how their brain works during this thinking. In the future, with my group, I would like to continue our work and on the one side, I would like to really try and dig deeper into what is exactly the role of language in the creation of abstract number concepts. Is language or are the multiple languages that multilinguals speak at the core of these uh, abstract number concepts that children develop? This is an open question and I would really like to contribute to solving it. And the pendant for spatial cognition would be that I would also like to know more about what is the role of this spatial thinking about numbers. Does it help us do math better or is it just something that is there from the start and on which we build our mathematical thinking? These are challenges I hope we can be able to contribute to them.